The Seven Wonders of the World. Hey there, Globetrotters. Ready to embark on a hilarious journey to the Seven Wonders of the World in 2024? Buckle up, because this is going to be one fun ride. We're talking ancient cities, epic statues, and enough history to make your head spin, but in a good way, I promise. So grab your passports, pack your sense of humor, and get ready to explore the world with me. All right, folks, first up on our whirlwind adventure, the Great Wall of China. Now, you've probably heard that this thing is so massive, you can see it from space. And that's, well, that's mostly true. It's more like you can kinda sorta make it out if you squint really hard and the lighting is just right. But hey, who am I to argue with centuries of folklore? Historian, this wall is seriously impressive though. I mean, can you imagine building something this long without the help of like a thousand dump trucks and a couple of cranes? They didn't even have those back then. It took centuries to build, and let me tell you, my back hurts just thinking about all that manual labor. But you know what they say, teamwork makes the dream work. And this wall is a testament to what humans can achieve when we all chip in and you know haul a few million bricks. Tourist, walking along the wall you can practically feel the history beneath your feet. You can almost hear the echoes of ancient soldiers marching, the whispers of emperors plotting, and maybe even the faint sound of someone complaining about their aching back. And the views? Don't even get me started on the views. Rolling hills, lush forests, and the occasional mountain goat just casually hanging out on a cliff. It's enough to make you want to grab a paintbrush and channel your inner Bob Ross. It's not just about the history or the views. It's about the feeling you get when you're standing on top of it, looking out at the vast expanse of China and realizing that you're part of something much bigger than yourself. So, if you ever get the chance to visit the Great Wall of China, do it. Just maybe pack some comfortable shoes. Your feet will thank me later. And don't forget to bring a camera because every angle is a postcard waiting to happen. The Great Wall is not just a structure. It's a living, breathing piece of history that continues to inspire awe and wonder in everyone who visits. So lace up those hiking boots, grab your sense of adventure, and get ready to be amazed by one of the greatest wonders of the world. Next stop on our adventure. Petra Jordan. Get ready to step into a world of ancient wonders and timeless beauty. This place is like something straight out of an Indiana Jones movie, minus the giant rolling boulders, probably. It's an adventurer's dream come true. We're talking hidden temples, ancient tombs, and enough mystery to make Sherlock Holmes jealous. The sheer scale and grandeur of Petra's rock-cut architecture are simply breathtaking. Tourist, imagine walking through a narrow canyon, the walls towering above you, and then BAM! The anticipation builds with every step you take. You turn a corner and you're face to face with the treasury, this incredible temple carved directly into the rock face. It's a sight that leaves you in awe. It's like something out of a dream, only it's real and you can touch it, but please don't touch it. Those restoration costs are no joke. The intricate carvings tell stories of a bygone era. Petra was once a bustling trading center, a crossroads of cultures and commerce. Imagine the vibrant life that once filled these streets. Today, it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a reminder that even the most advanced civilizations eventually crumble, leaving behind only whispers of their former glory. The passage of time is evident in the weathered stones. Local guide. You can practically hear the echoes of camel caravans, the chatter of merchants haggling over prices, and maybe even the faint sound of Indiana Jones cracking his whip. Okay, maybe not that last one. The stories of the past come alive through the guide's narration. One of the coolest things about Petra is that there's so much to discover. Every corner holds a new surprise. You can explore the sick, the narrow gorge that leads to the city. It's like walking through a natural corridor of history. Marvel at the monastery, another impressive temple carved into the rock face. Its grandeur rivals that of the treasury. Or channel your inner explorer and hike to some of the lesser known tombs and caves. These hidden gems offer a sense of discovery and adventure. And if you're feeling really adventurous, you can even spend the night in a Bedouin camp under the stars. The desert night sky is a spectacle in itself. Just watch out for scorpions. I'm kidding, mostly. The desert is full of surprises, both big and small. Petra is a place that will stay with you long after you've left. The memories you make here are unforgettable. Plus, it's a great place to get some Instagram-worthy photos. Just saying. Every angle offers a picture-perfect moment. 
Get ready to be wowed, folks, because we're headed to Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, to visit the magnificent Christ the Redeemer. This iconic statue is like the Statue of Liberty's cooler, more laid-back cousin. And let's be honest, who wouldn't want to hang out with a giant statue overlooking one of the most beautiful cities in the world? It's a must-see for anyone visiting Rio. Architecturally stunning and standing tall atop Corcovado Mountain, Christ the Redeemer is truly a sight to behold. Its grandeur is unmatched. You can see it from pretty much everywhere in Rio, arms outstretched as if to say, welcome to my city, baby. And trust me, you'll feel pretty darn welcomed with those stunning views of Sugarloaf Mountain, Copacabana Beach, and the sprawling city below. It's like the statue is embracing the entire city. Now I know what you're thinking. Arun, how on earth did they get a giant statue up there? Well, my friends, it wasn't easy. It was a monumental task. It took nine years to build this masterpiece, and they used a combination of trains, cranes, and sheer willpower to get all those pieces of concrete and soapstone to the top of the mountain. Imagine the dedication and hard work that went into this. Talk about a workout, but the effort was worth it. The result is nothing short of spectacular. Young explorer Christ the Redeemer has become a symbol of hope and inspiration for people all over the world. It's a beacon of faith and unity. It's a reminder that even in the face of adversity, there's always something to believe in. The statue stands tall through all weather, symbolizing resilience. Plus, it makes for one heck of a selfie backdrop. Your Instagram feed will thank you. To reach this iconic landmark, you can take a scenic train ride through the lush Tijuca forest, offering breathtaking views along the way. It's an adventure in itself. And once you're at the top, well, let's just say you'll wanna have your camera ready. The panoramic views are simply unforgettable, capturing the essence of Rio in one frame. Fasten your seatbelts, adventurers, because we're heading to Peru to explore the ancient Incan city of Machu Picchu. Local guide. This place is so high up in the Andes Mountains, you might need an oxygen tank and a Sherpa just to catch your breath. Young explorer, but trust me, the views alone are worth the altitude sickness. Imagine this, you've trekked through the sacred valley, braved the Inca Trail, or maybe just hopped on a bus, no judgment here. And suddenly, through the mist and clouds, you spot it. Local guide Machu Picchu, young explorer, this ancient city hidden away for centuries is like a secret whispered on the wind. As you wander through the ruins, you can't help but feel a sense of awe. Local guide, the Incas were master builders, creating intricate stone structures that have withstood the test of time and earthquakes. Young explorer, you've got temples, palaces, terraces, all perfectly integrated into the natural landscape. It's like mother nature herself said, hold my chicha morada. I'm going to make an architectural masterpiece. Local guide, but the real mystery of Machu Picchu, young explorer, no one really knows its true purpose. Was it a royal estate, a religious center, a giant agricultural experiment, local guide? Maybe it was just a really cool place to get away from it all. Chichen Itza is a place where history comes alive. You can practically feel the energy of the ancient Mayans, hear the echoes of their rituals, and maybe even learn a thing or two about astronomy and acoustics. Plus, it's a great place to work on your tan. Just saying. As you wander through the gardens, admire the reflecting pools, and gaze up at the towering minarets, you can't help but feel a sense of peace and tranquility. It's a reminder that even in a world full of chaos and uncertainty, there's still beauty to be found, love to be shared, and marble to be admired. And there you have it, folks, the seven wonders of the world in 2024. Which one are you adding to your bucket list? Let us know in the comments below. From the Great Wall of China to the Taj Mahal, we've explored some of the most awe-inspiring and hilarious destinations on the planet. We've learned about history, culture, and the importance of packing comfortable shoes. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more fun adventures. Until next time, keep wandering and wondering.